it's autumn in fact it's November it's the 1st of November 2016 06.15 hours Greenwich Mean Time which for me is really winter it's a Tuesday I got the day off it's Cardiff it's supposed to be foggy but it's not it's chilly and um, calm Where has this year gone? Current location and red sky in the morning looking south towards Cardiff. It's quite nice actually. Eunice Willows. I wonder. These are lots of beers. What every good pub should have now, power and charging. Anyway, on to the beer in a more well lit booth. Not altogether sure if I prefer it. I like the particular. It looks better for my eyes. So, uh, oh, hang on. It's from Magic Rock. It's a red ale. My memory's gone. And I'm urgently checking my phone. Phoenix Red. Castle Rock, 5.5%. A bit cold. Hmm. Hoppy. Englishly hoppy. Hope it's not a twig juice, as some people say. Full bodied. Hmm. Quite sharp. Touch lemony, nice long bitter finish. I like that. B plus and a bit. 5.5, more of a sipper for me. Long day ahead. Well, I'm drinking really slowly today. But I need my chips. Chips done. Been so Wales for a quick one. Unfortunately, can't be in taps not open. Yeah, it is a good thing. It is a deal for fine cascades, especially new ones, so I can't use my tokens, so this is quite nice. And I'll do them until I get the small bar. Only $1.99. Should be $2.99. Small bar. Small bar. Not particularly small. Forgot to do a carpet stroke flooring for Mr. Manning. I think it's really wood. It looks really wood. Anyway, this is real cherries. Boom, bone. Food creek, 6.5% alcohol by volume. And 4 degrees Celsius apparently. Not cheap. Oh, that lambicky, cherry, piggy. It's full of fruit. B plus plus a bit. <laughs> oh, the cherries go on and on, which is 3.75 on the untapped scale. Yes, indeed. Oh, it's great, you. Here's my advice. Always check the fridge. This is Claudia. By the more beer co from Bristol, from whence the small bar comes. 4.5% alcohol by volume. A hoppy wheat beer. Mm. And it smells hoppy. Wonderfully hoppy. Oh, sharply hoppy, hoppy. That's what you want. B plus plus. Straight on the case. Talking nonsense. Oh, oh wow. And you'll never guess who I just saw who's walking here. Ex gravity station. Sage words indeed. Real. 
flags, Mr. Manning. Well, uh, anyway, onto the ale. Grey trees, magnificent grey trees. Chinookka BPA, 0.2% alcohol by volume. Pale and interesting. Hmm, not much of an aroma. Huge citrusy lemony taste, which I like. B plus and a bit, and a huge finish. That's what it's all about. So, here's the question. This is Chili Brown, note the name, by Hot Craft, 5% alcohol by volume. Is this Sue's Chili Plum Porter, which is already on? I'm not sure the strength, I should have looked at that. Or is it a variation? The battle is on. Let's have a taste. I can't even say taste correctly. No, it's definitely not the same brew. This is far more porter than chili. I'm saying so too Gaza one. It's far more of a porter finish than a chili finish. Could get in trouble. Technical term, penultimate. Pixie's piece from Gaza, 3.9% alcohol by volume. I have a feeling this may be a bit hoppy. Look how full that is. Hibiscus. <coughs> oh, only in the finish. A bit light. Oh, oh, oh. only B plus. Well made, but thin. Nice finish, but yeah, thin, B plus. Sorry, sir. Floor from Mr. Manning. I think these are from the Vale, i.e. the Vale of Glamorgan. Thomas Alilford, COB, Cobb, 4% alcohol by volume. Big croaky. Mmm. different. Touch sweet, touch tingly, touch B plus in a bit. It's great here in the hot bunker. Great stuff as well. 